a very good evening to all the mbbs bds aspirants i welcome you back to our channel uh, we are very glad to host you this is your presenter navin harjwani here uh, from india to international pune uh, we welcome you again we welcome all the parents if any parents are watching this video this video is very important uh, it will be very useful at the time of counseling uh, because it has all the abbreviations, the short forms that are mentioned in counseling brochure and their exact meaning and the eligibility of those particular quota seats we are going to discuss today. So kindly watch this video till the end. It will be very useful to you. And if you have liked this uh, information, you may always like, subscribe and share the video if this information you think is useful to someone else also you can always share so without wasting any time let's begin the first step towards achieving your dreams is having the right coach get the best education with india to international and make your ndms and mbbs dreams come true download the app now the first step towards achieving so now this is about ncc counseling meet ug 2023 you can clearly read it on your screen different quotas under ncc counseling and respective eligibilities with the abbreviation what does these seats mean so today we are going to discuss about all india quota seats aims all the aims seats central university like banara sindhu university aligarh muslim university jamia jipmar okay Deemed University, there are two different uh, category seats. In fact, uh, three different category seats. One is minority, one is management, and another is NRI. And we are also going to discuss about IPU, Central University Eligibility Quota seats. So kindly watch this video up till end so that uh, you are able to uh, note it down. We have made a page-wise uh, presentation. Uh, you will take a five second pause between every page so that you can take a screenshot and keep it it will be very helpful at the time of choice filling thank you now starting with you can see on uh, the uh, top we have mentioned quota and meaning of abbreviations and eligibility okay now let's begin with first is all india quota aiq aiq means all India quota seats, all the candidates who are qualified in NEET 223 who would be qualifying, okay, can apply in these seats. Secondly, we can see it's AIMS open. That These are open seats in AIM for every candidate from across India can apply on these seats. Second, third, it's AIMS NRI, okay, foreign national seats. These are named as foreign national seats. But it is not that foreign national has a different quota, NRI has a different quota, PIO quota is different, OCI quota is different. No, foreign national seats means all the candidates who are foreigners, who are NRI, person of Indian origin, overseas citizen of India are eligible for these seats. AMU internal quota seats. Okay, that is Aligarh Muslim University internal quota seats. Now, what does we mean by internal quota seats? The candidate who passed their qualifying from Aligarh Muslim University uh, affiliated schools but regular okay candidates who passed out from Aligarh Muslim University affiliated schools that is for 11th and 12th you may call it as a junior college okay the candidates who have passed from Aligarh Muslim University moving ahead with AMU open now all the candidates who are qualified from across India are eligible for open Aligarh Muslim University seats AMU also has an uh, NRI quota. So all the foreigners, NRI, person of Indian origin, overseas of overseas citizen of India are eligible for these seats. Moving ahead with BHU, Banara Sindhu University open. Okay, open seats for in Banara Sindhu University. Everybody can apply, whoever is qualified from across India. We'll take a two second pause so that you can take a screenshot of the same. Okay, now moving ahead with Delhi University. Kindly note, candidates who are from Delhi, please kindly listen to this very carefully. Read it very carefully. We have tried to uh, uh, write it in a very layman language, a very understandable language. I will tell you all about it. screenshot it. Delhi University, we have different quotas. Now, Delhi University, we have Delhi CW. Now, what is CW quota? Delhi University quota for children of uh, 
of army who got metered at uh, due to any reasons okay or it is reserved for widows of army uh, person who got metered matlab jo shaheed ho gaye ha na kisi bhi karan march aur wo armed force mein serve kar rahe the military mein serve kar rahe the air force mein serve kar rahe the kahin pe bhi serve kar rahe the aur kisi karan march wo shaheed ho gaye ha na to unke liye ek quota hai and this, that quota is named as delhi cw okay kindly note delhi university du quota seats now 85% of the seats are reserved for those who have passed 11th and 12th examination from delhi or near capital region okay nct near capital territory ip university again also has the same quota as delhi university children or the widows of matria who were serving indian armed forces ha na jo military air force mein kaam kar rahe the aur agar unke husband ya unke father जो शहीद हो चुके है ना तो उनके लिए एक कोटा है आईपी यूनिवर्सिटी में एंड दिल्ली यूनिवर्सिटी में ना आईपी यूनिवर्सिटी आईपी कोटा सीट्स अगेन सेम एज दिल्ली दिल्ली कोटा सीट्स 85 परसेंट सीट्स आर रिजर्व फॉर द कैंडिडेट्स हु पास 11th एंड 12th फ्रॉम दिल्ली आईपीटी ईएसआई इंश्योर्ड पर्सन ओके नाउ कैंडिडेट्स हु आर द बोर्ड ऑफ इंश्योर्ड पर्सन शुड हैव काइंडली मार्क दिस शुड हैव एन बोर्ड ऑफ इंश्योर्ड पर्सन सर्टिफिकेट आपके पास वो सर्टिफिकेट होना बहुत जरूरी है इस कोटे में अगर आपको अप्लाई करना है जिपमर ओपन सीट्स ओके पॉंडीचेरी एनीबडी कैन अप्लाई अक्रॉस फ्रॉम इंडिया हु आर क्वालिफाइड जिपमर एन आर आई सीट्स अगेन फॉरन नेशनल सीट्स दीज आर मेन डेस्ट जिपमर फॉरन नेशनल सीट्स ऑल द फॉरनर्स एन आर आई पी आई ओ सी आई विल बी एलिजिबल फॉर दीज सीट्स विल टेक अ टू सेकेंड पॉज सो दैट यू कैन टेक अ स्क्रीन शॉट ऑफ द सेम moving ahead then we have jipmer pondicherry domicile seats pondicherry uh, jipmer uh, seats which are available only for the candidates who are a domicile of pondicherry union territory okay coming up with jamia open now these jamia open seats are open to all the ug qualified students across india <coughs> excuse me <coughs> now we have jamia internal quota seats so these seats are for the candidates who have passed the 11th 12th exam from jamia affiliated schools but as a regular students jamia also has a muslim minority quota seats it is known as jamia muslim candidates who belong to muslim minority can apply on these seats across india jamia muslim women now this is for the seats uh, exclusively reserved for muslim female candidates okay okay i hope you're getting the thing i hope i am not too fast uh, coming on to deemed university then in deemed university we have jain minority deemed university we have muslim minority management seats and nri seats now jain minority we have um two colleges one is medical and one is dental both are based out of vadodara the medical college is sumandeep medical college vadodara and uh, dental college is km shayam dental college vadodara these are exclusively reserved for jain minority students candidates who belong to jain community okay they have a quota of jain minority in sumandeep medical college and km shah dental college vadodara coming ahead uh, coming uh, uh, on muslim minority we have three different deemed universities in under muslim minority okay now these three deemed university two are medical one is dental janopaya medical college mangalore janopaya dental college mangalore and hamdard delhi medical deemed university they have muslim minority quota deemed management paid seats these are general seats candidates who want to take a management seat or paid seat or a general seat under merit quota in deemed university all the candidates are qualified all the candidates who are qualified from all india can apply on these seats deemed nri quota seats foreign national seats which is also known as deemed nri quota okay all the foreigners nri person of indian origin oci are eligible for these seats we will take a two second pause so that you can take a screenshot of the same 
and this is about ourselves uh, we provide uh, counseling services paid counseling services admission guidance across india okay and i am myself navin harjwani your presenter uh, who is in this industry since last 16 years and we provide guidance to the best of our abilities we have enough resources uh, to give you the best of knowledge uh, while you are uh, participating in counseling or while you are reporting we help you out with each and everything with each and every notification with each and every eligibility uh, awareness we make you aware of each and every eligibility every state notification every counseling how you need to appear and everything about documents so i hope do you have liked this video uh, i hope uh, uh, you will like and subscribe for our channel god bless you all thank you have a wonderful weekend uh, god bless you all thank you